Okay, there we go. Okay, so we're going to make our pinwheels for our Child Abuse Awareness Month. We are going to color them this part first. We're gonna, this is your pinwheel part. Then the second step will be to color your flower. Once you have both of these colored, you may raise your hand and I will come around and I will give you the rest of the parts that you need to make your pinwheel so that it will look like this, okay? But first, I wanted to go over what we just talked about. So what was something that we were discussing today about child abuse awareness, Brielle? Yes, when you feel uncomfortable or unsafe, you can say stop and you can say no. Joseph, what was something else that we talked about? We talked about um, if you feel unsafe, you can go to other people and um, if um, somebody is trying to hurt you, you just say no stop. Yes, so Joseph said that we talked about who we could go to if we felt unsafe. Joseph, do you want to tell us your five people? Good choices. His mom, his dad, grandma, grandpa, and his teacher. Um, would anyone else like to share their five choices? Johnny. So he chose to put some of his friends' dads that he felt comfortable going to, an uncle and his mom. Those are all good choices, right? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to ask some of my, I'm going to pick two people to pass out the pinwheel, and then I'll choose two people to pass out the flowers. So what was our first step, Navabi? What were we going to do first? We're going to color our pinwheel, right? Um, Alora, what was the second step? Um, to put them together. Color our flower. And then when you guys are finished, I will come around and give you the rest of the pieces. You're going to need a tube like this for the bottom, and that's how we're going to stick it in the ground. And then you'll also have a little piece back here in the back. It's a little plastic piece that you're going to fold these. Let me show you guys really quick. So you're going to fold these pinwheels. Once you're done coloring them, we're gonna put them all together like this so that they're all stuck together. And then the little plastic piece that I give you, there's little holes right here. And as you fold those together, you'll wanna line up the holes because then your little plastic piece is gonna go through these holes and into the center hole that's in the flower. Okay, and then there's another little plastic piece that will go in the front to hold it all together. And I'll help you guys do that. Once you're done coloring, I'll come around and help you, okay? Okay. All right. <laughs> 